Today we're using a chainsaw to save trees and restore an ecosystem. You heard me right. This right here, this is a post oak and behind it we got a white oak. These are upland hardwood species that depend on fire to outcompete the faster growing species. But these, these trees haven't had fire. So we have sweet gums and maples and cherries and loblollies taking over. See, look how small these trees are. And behind it, we have a sweet gum that's three times the size, but it's the exact same age. And of course, we got some maples and a lot more sweet gums. So we're gonna cut down these sweet gums. That's gonna bring in sunlight and allow these oaks to take off and really grow. Those post oaks like being in wide open spaces where they can really sprawl out. That's their growth structure. Their limbs reach out really far. Uh, sweet gums, maples, loblollies, cherries, their growth structure is very narrow. They can get up through the canopy and outcompete other tree species. And there you go, look at all that sunlight for those post oaks and white oaks. And yeah, there's a little bit of a mess on the ground, but that's gonna provide cover until we can get fire in here to establish native wildflowers and grasses. And that is how you restore a savanna.